I know it's not my usual infernal greetings, but this one isn't really that kind of video. This one is after thinking and listening to everybody bitch about politics. You know what? Both sides, Republicans and Democrats, are hypocrites. Okay? Because the Republicans are doing this, and the Democrats are doing that. Just, it's politics. What you should be worried about is the change that's taking place, that has taken place in the United States. There's no such thing as a capitalist society, people. Once we got conglomerates and we got corporations buying out their little companies that there was their competition, they kept a fair market price going, and then that corporate company or that conglomerate could then charge whatever the hell they wanted for the product. That ended capitalism. If you live in a democracy that claims it's capitalist, such as the United States, they are fucking liars. Democracies that claim to be capitalist are nothing. When they, you have the big companies taken over like they have successfully done in the United States are no longer capitalists. What they are as corporatists. You get what they want you to have and that's how it is at the price they want you to have it. They have all these people lobbying down in D.C. And they're allowed to have lobbyists to get the lawmakers to do what they want them to do. So therefore, your voice is taken out of it. Even corporate America decides what laws are being passed. How this happened? Easy. Because instead of the government being afraid of its constituents, the constituents are afraid of the government. The United States can no longer say it's a government of the people, by the people, for the people. What the new motto is, is by the government, for corporations, fuck the citizens. You know it's getting bad when they want to put cameras on the streets. Where I live, they're starting to put the cameras on the streets. Is it an invasion of privacy? No doubt about it. They have, the Constitution says you're free to do with your property as you please. However, now they want to see what you're doing on your property. Why? Because they're too fucking lazy to get off their ass, crawl in a cruiser, and go around to fight crime. It's too easy to go to the donut shop and fight the crime with cameras. Now, they're going to tell you as they always do. Every time they take away your rights, they always tell you, we're doing this for your good because somebody can do this. They use fear to let you steal your rights from you. They're going to tell you that, well, when we put them in, you'll have access to them on your computer. And you can go and watch the crimes and report them to us. Yeah, they're going to do that. And so they have the whole system in place. Once they have it all in place, you're going to be, night, be denied access, and they're going to be watching you. Frankly, if that's what they got to do, put one in my bathroom right in the toilet so you can watch me shit in your face. And put one in my bedroom since you want to stick your nose in my bedroom so damn bad. And learn how to do it properly. Okay? Fact is, the cameras are there to control the populace while they're lying to you and telling you it's for your own good. Didn't Hitler do the same thing? Didn't the communists do the same thing? We're doing this for your own good? But then they used them to oppress the very people that they said they were going to do it for their own good for. 
No. Take a look at the police. How many of them can pass a physical test? Or how many of them look like they could use a diet? Majorly. How many of them are bigoted? How many of them use hate and fear? And the big selling point is take a look at their uniforms. Compare them to an old Nazi SS uniform. Every single uniform is going to black and becoming more and more like the SS uniforms. Open your eyes. Look around. There's no such thing as a democracy anymore. They're taking your rights away. And whose fault is it? Your fault? If you don't stand up and do something about it, then you don't deserve the rights. People fought to get those rights, and now the government is taking them away. How long before the government uses the troops, our own military, to oppress us? Rights are being taken away. Look at what Bush did with the Patriot Act. He can pretty much stop all your rights. And you know what? Obama's not that much better, even though I voted for him, where he wants to take control of our access to the Internet. I'm paying for it, so it's none of his fucking business what I'm doing. If you don't like that, too fucking bad. Just like I tell everybody else. Kiss my ass. It's my Internet. I pay for it. Mind your business. If I'm doing something like setting up a terrorist act or something I absolutely fucking despise and think they should have their nuts cut off pedophilia, yeah, then you stick your fucking nose in my business but until then, what I search for what I do on the internet my access to the internet is none of their fucking business because I'm paying for it 